I look at this as a responder perspective, this has been something that's been the dreaming for me. The missing link for many, many years was being side by side with some of the back with really good technologists, people that I would say are as good, most likely better than me, which was very similar to how it was when I was the Navy SEALs, is being surrounded by peers that were just absolutely best of breed and able to do things. And so it was 20 years in the making to solve a problem that we in this in the SEALs had and to where we are today and really its formation is from problems I saw way back when and then identifying people that are that are I'm grateful to be surrounded with to help solve the problem. Excellent. Rajesh, yeah. do you have a few oh, words? Thanks. Uh, thanks, Jeff. Yeah, that, that was uh, an important piece, um, knowing the need for these kinds of solutions uh, in the marketplace, I guess. So I come from a wireless technology background uh, and myself and a few others worked in the wireless industry for uh, well over a quarter century. Uh, I worked in many different aspects of wireless, uh, multiple uh, generations of cellular, Wi-Fi, Bluetooth and so on. And so and we've did a lot of work on protocols and state machines and so on. And so we have we bring a lot of experience from that perspective. But when it was combined with this particular need, uh, that made it all the you know, very meaningful for us. So when we started developing the location tech solution, we <clears throat> put in a few guiding principles and, and I'll just briefly touch on those here and we'll build on them as we go along on in individual slides. And the first part is to have minimal infrastructure because you can solve a lot of problems by throwing a lot of hardware at it, but when you look at the hospitality industry, cost is a big constraint. And so throwing in a lot of hardware is going to add up the cost. More importantly, it's going to make the deployments that much more complicated. So reducing, keeping the infrastructure to the minimal level was an important guiding principle. The second part, and maybe this should be the first one, but how accurate, Jeff alluded to the importance of location, but how accurate are those location fixes? So from our engineering backgrounds, of an R&D background, this was really important. Like we needed to get it right, but at the same time, it couldn't be a very heavy-duty solution. Right? Again, going along with that first thing I mentioned about minimal infrastructure. So that was the second thing that our location prediction, location fixes had to be very accurate. The third one was, as engineers, we hate painting ourselves into a corner. So we want the system to be expandable. Right? It it shouldn't be something that you do it, and if you want to make a change, you have to fix, you have to rip it out and change everything. So, so that was another guiding principle that it had to be able to support additional functionality without doing a lot of changes. The fourth one was not to fall into the trap of not invented here syndrome. In other words, if there is a solution out there for a problem, let's just use it. Right? We we are better off if we can solve new problems for things that don't exist. That's where we can add value. Just reinventing the wheel is of no interest to us. So that was another thing that if we could reuse something, and that's why we chose the uh, sort of the LoRa thing that we talked. About, I'm going to talk about shortly, because there is a big ecosystem of devices out there, and we don't need to create those. We don't need to reinvent those things. So that was another thing. Don't reinvent the wheel. Um, and then finally, uh, and perhaps most crucially for the end user, keep it simple and intuitive to use. The deployment should be simple and it should be really easy to use. Right? We can make it very complicated. We can add all kinds of bells and whistles. But in our experience, those are systems that actually don't get used. They might be really nice and they might be great. You might feel great buying it. But if you don't use it, it doesn't serve the purpose. So these are the five sort of guiding principles that um, we had in mind uh, going into kind of the location text uh, journey. 